Hello boys and girls, nice to see you again, hope you're all well. Today I'm going to read a story about two badgers. Here they are. One's called Tick, and one's called Tack. And the story's called Laundry Day. And uh, I think they're going to help to hang all the clean washing on the line. The story is by Jessica Bagley and she also did the pictures. Let's have a look inside. Oh look, here's all the washing pegged out to dry and this looks like the garden where they play. You can see they've got some books, they've got things to play with and trees to climb. Laundry day. I'm bored, said Tick. Me too, said Tack. Why don't you two read a book? You love to read, said Ma Badger. We read all our books, said Tick. Then we read them backwards, said Tack. Look, all those clothes, some of them are flying off the top of the pile. Well, how about building a fort, asked Ma Badger. We already made one, said Tick. Then we invaded it and it fell apart, said Tack. What about fishing? asked Ma Badger, tiredly. We caught all the fish in the pond, said Tick. Then we let them go, said Tack. Well, would you like to help me hang the laundry? said Ma Badger. Laundry? Tick asked, looking surprised. We haven't done that yet, said Tack. OK. They chimed together. What a good idea. Let me show you how. Take the wet clothes and sheets out of the basket. Don't let them fall on the ground. Then take the clothes pins and clip them on the line. Like this. Ask Tick. Very good, said Ma Badger. It's so easy, shouted Tack from the other end of the clothesline. Will you boys finish hanging the laundry for me while I go to the market? asked Ma Badger. Sure, Ma, chirped Tick and Tack. So they were going to be very helpful. Tick and Tack quickly went to work hanging every shirt, sock, sheet and sweater that was in the basket. That was fun, but we're out of laundry already, said Tick. Hmm, I have an idea, said Tack. I wonder what it is. We can hang the winter clothes and blankets, said Tack. Good thinking, said Tick. Once those items were hung, Tick and Tack looked at the line. That's it. We're out of clothes and sheets, said Tick. But we're not out of twine, said Tack with a grin. So they were going to look for something else. Tick and Tack ran inside and each grabbed an apple barrel full of odds and ends from the house and started to hang them up. This is great, shouted Tick. It sure is. What else is there? asked Tack. Good heavens, there's so many things there. They ran all over the house, gathering every whatnot, bauble and trinket they could find. They picked up every knick-knack, this and that, and bric-a-brac in the house. They grabbed buckets and books. They pilfered the pots, pirated pillows. They looted lampshades and even took the toaster. They hung everything they could find that wasn't nailed down. We're really good at this, said Tick proudly. I'm pretty impressed myself, said Tack. Good heavens, scissors, telephone, chair, so many things. But just then, Ma came home from the market. Now I wonder what Ma's going to say. <gasps> Look, 
Tick and tack. What have you done? She hollered. Um, we hung up the laundry, said Tick. Uh, and a few other things, said Tack. Well, I'm not sure how you did it, said Ma Badger. But you forgot a couple of things. I wonder what they forgot. Can you think? Yes, I'm bored, said Tick. Me too, said Tack. I wonder if Ma needs help with dinner. <laughs> I'm not sure. Look, here are some of the things hung on the line. And there is the back cover and the front and back cover. And here we are. Laundry Day, a funny story about two little badgers. I hope you enjoyed it. It was very funny. See you again soon. Goodbye.